their report. In fact, the roots to this thing, if you haven't already memorized this, it's nice to have this in your notes. Designing what sort of system, remember what we called it? Starts with an R, regulator. We're assuming no input, we're talking about inputs and producing GF. So we're just saying the only input to the system is feedback to state. We haven't put any what's called exogenous inputs to drive the system. Right now it's just a regulator. Alright. Well, uh, let's see.
A goes to its original A matrix. And I'm just going to call this a T2 error, T right hand all the time. Minus our B matrix. I'll just take this coefficient B2 times K1, K2. Zero. All the coefficients for this equation are in one. That B matrix came from the zero KIJ. Yeah, I just found this out of people writing okay. K over J. I don't know if people writing minus uh, B equivalent over J equivalent, so call it A22. Got it. All right. All right. So here's our desired characters equation. In our, came from our uh, design. Here's our characters equation comes from our controller. They have to be Now, if it's not a nice controllable form, you'll have to find the SI minus A. Since it's controllable form, What's the wise thing to do at this point? If you have time in the test, which you'll have plenty of time in the test to do this. Let's see, homework, you will have time to do this. Right? What we do all day? I've got a solution here. Check it. Let me check it. See if I what well, best about it? Do I know the system's stable? Thank you. 
substituting in minus A22 minus B2 2 sigma plus A22 all over B2. And if you, well, B2s cancel out this in this guy, uh, you'll end up with 0, 1 minus 2 sigma squared. So, yeah, there's your coefficients for coefficients for Because I'm in control of four. It becomes quite simple. Okay. Questions on this? As far as we've gotten in this class so far, uh, what we'll be doing after breaking things is, let's say, oh, oh I can't put it, I only have a center on, let's say, position. I don't have a this assumes what? I have a center on position and a center on velocity. And I'm feeding back uh, right here uh, uh, K1 and K2. Uh, this one is mark is a gain times position. That's a gain times velocity. Right? If I don't have those, well, I need to design something I can do. So there's And then I have taken each of these states, uh, multiplying times Dot is equal to 
minus V equivalent over J equivalent plus what's coming through from U. And U is defined as X1 times K1 plus X2 times K2. Right. Okay. That assumes I have a transducer here. I can monitor this. I can measure X1 which is theta from here. Assuming that I can measure X2 which is omega. Because it's that measurement times K1 and that measurement times K2. What we'll be doing after break is maybe I can't measure that. Can I still implement this? The answer is yes, but we'll have to do a thing that we call an observer. Right now we're assuming we can measure all the states. 